Good old Michael Jordan. If you grew up like me, you grew up watching this man dominate the NBA for a number of years. But why am I showing Mike on a crypto channel? Well, if you look at that number that he's rocking on the left, you can see it's 23. And ladies and gentlemen, if you have not been keeping up with the news, Volt Inu just listed on their 23rd centralized exchange in less than five months, which is insane. If you're part of the Volt Army and you are voltish on this news, you know what to do. Smash that like button and spam the comments. Flood the comments with electricity bolts below to show how strong the Volt Army is. 23 exchanges in five months. Now, I have to tell you guys a quick story. I think it was probably three or four weeks ago, Voltoshi tweeted out. He said, Volt will be on 30 centralized exchanges by summertime. And I'll be honest with you. It's not that I didn't believe him, but I was like, they're only on about 12 right now. That's two months to get on 18 exchanges. I don't know if it's going to happen. Well, guess what? This dev team has delivered beyond belief and Volt Inu is officially on 23 centralized exchanges as of right now. Round of applause to the Volt Inu dev team for executing. Now, one of the reasons that this is bullish, guys, in these bearish times, Volt Inu is getting on these major exchanges. I personally believe in the exchange effect. The ex exchange effect is... The more tokens or the more exchanges that a token is on, the more people that have accessibility and access to it. A lot of these exchanges are region by region. Voyager can't even operate in New York City, and it's available in 49 other states. So I like it. I like the exchange play, and especially as the market picks up, as especially as Volt Inu gains more mainstream attention, well, people don't have to go to Uniswap anymore. They can go to their regional exchange that they use. But I tweeted this out earlier today. Volt Inu has been listed on 23 exchanges in less than five months. The only other coin or token to accomplish this feat is ApeCoin. And you guys remember when ApeCoin launched on March 16th? They got on to Kraken. They got on to uh, Voyager. We just talked about them. They got on to Binance US. They also got on to... They got on every exchange. That's what it is. Uh, in a matter of minutes, right? OKX, they got on. Cuboy, they got on. Gate.io, like all of these different exchanges in a matter of minutes. Now, I tweeted this out and... For the most part, I do believe it to be true. The only other token I can imagine is SHIB, but SHIB had a long period where it didn't have any mainstream attraction. When it started to pick up back in May of 2021, uh, it, it got on a ton of exchanges, Coinbase, Binance, a ton of exchanges very quickly. But it wasn't in the first five months, I don't believe. I think ApeCoin is the only other one. And if I am wrong on this and someone finds out, leave a comment below and I'll stand corrected. But from, from my understanding... The only other token that's gotten listed on more exchanges this quick is ApeCoin, guys. Very, very bullish news for Volt Inu. And you can see here the Volt Inu, the team, they tweeted this out. They said, Volt is going ape. Volt is going ape. Don't say you weren't warned. Well, you were uh, you were warned by your boy, Jake Gagan, as I tweeted this out earlier today. Make sure to give me a follow on Twitter as well, guys. And let me know your thoughts on this. 23, 23 exchanges in five months. As the market picks back up, I think this is going to be big news for the team. Congratulations to the Volt Army on executing. They said 30 exchanges by summertime. I don't know when summer officially starts. I'm going to say it's going to be June, July, and August. But here we are on May 18th, 23 centralized exchanges. Very, very bullish news. Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments. It's some voltage news coming here live. We appreciate your guys' support. 23 exchanges. Are you kidding me? In a matter of five months. Huge news here. Thank you guys. And we will see you all on the next episode. Stay safe, keep investing, and we'll see you guys soon. Peace out, everybody.